Hello everyone. Today I'm going to explain to you all how we teach multiplying by 2, by 5 and by 10 in primary. Okay, so first of all I'm going to show you three questions and then we're going to have a look at how we show the children um, groups of numbers in order to help them to understand how to multiply. Okay, so for example, if we look at 3 multiplied by 2. Okay, so in the image that you can see, you can see three monsters. There are three monsters on the screen. Each monster has two legs. So we have our three monsters. Okay. The three monsters that appear here all have two legs. One, two, three, four, five, six. We are teaching the children to count in twos. Two, four, six. So, what is three monsters multiplied by two legs? Two, four, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Here we go. 3 times 2 equals 6. Okay? The next question. We have 3 times 5. Again, we're going to use the same method. We're going to have our three monsters. Three monsters. Our monsters now have five legs. Okay? So, what do we do now? We look at the monsters. We have three of them. We, they have five legs. We are explaining to the children that we are counting in groups of five. Multiplying by five is adding in fives. Okay? Counting in fives. Five, ten, fifteen. One, two, three, four, five. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. With the images of the monsters, we are explaining to them how to count in fives. They can, of course, count using their fingers, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. But in this method, we are grouping the numbers together, 5, 10, 15. Okay, so 3 times 5 is 15. The final image of the monsters is they have 10 legs, okay? So let's go with the 3 again, 3 times 10, okay? This method again, we have the 3 monsters, they all have 10 legs. What do we do? We count the legs, okay? So we've got our 3 monsters, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. They have 10 legs, okay? So, 3 groups of 10. 10, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 10, 20, 30, 10, 20, 30. Let's write it on the board. 10, 20, 30, okay? These are our monsters. 10, 20, 30. 3 times 10 is 30. Each monster has a set of 10 legs. So we are explaining to the children how we can count in groups, okay? Let's start again. Three times two, groups of two. Two, four, six. Groups of five in the second question. Five, 10, 15, okay? In the third question, 10, 20, 30. Groups of 10, each monster had 10 legs, okay? So we are multiplying by two, five, and 10 in a very simple way. We are explaining and sharing with your children how to count in groups of numbers, okay? So have a go at that one and see what you think. Thank you. Bye.